Blender and Blender BIM development moves really fast, so you may need to update your Blender or Blender BIM versions. With Blender open, first, on installing our current installation, we'll go to Edit, Preferences, Blender BIM. Then we'll untick this box, close Blender, reopen Blender, go to Edit, Preferences, search for BIM, here we have Blender BIM, and we'll press on Remove. This will remove our Blender BIM installation in a clean way. Make sure to first untick the box, close Blender, reopen Blender, and then press on Remove. Otherwise, you're gonna have a bug. To download the latest build, go to IFC Open Shell, click on Releases, and on the last release, you're going to download whichever version fits your case. For me, it's Python 3.10, Windows. Hit Save, then in Blender, go to Edit, Preferences, Install, choose the latest build, and click on Install Add-on. And now we'll press on Enable the Add-on. And that's it. We have now upgraded our Blender BIM version. We can make these steps a lot faster by using a little bit of code. Now, if you've never opened a command prompt before, you can still follow the steps that I'm going to show you. There's nothing complex, just a few commands. To sync our Blender BIM add-on installation with GitHub, we're going to need three prerequisites. The first one is to have Git installed in our computer. The second is to download a local copy of IFC Open Shell, and we also need to have Blender BIM already installed within Blender. If you don't have Git installed, please download it now, install it, and then follow along. Then we need IFC Open Shell. So just Google IFC Open Shell GitHub, and when you find this page, go to Code and click on Copy this link. We'll choose a directory in our computer. And here we'll write CMD. This will give us a command prompt where we can write git clone and paste our link, hit enter. Okay, that's done. We can now inspect what's been cloned. And let's go to source, Blender BIM, Blender BIM again, and we'll stop here. We put this window on the right hand side. We'll open Blender again. Go to Edit, Preferences, and look for your Blender BIM add-on. And then here, under File, you can see where your Blender BIM add-on has been installed. Navigate to wherever your add-on is installed. Blender, 3.6, Scripts, Add-ons, Blender BIM. OK. Now we'll put this folder on the left the Blender BIM add-on installation, and we also have the GitHub repo. Now we should just close Blender. We don't need this open anymore. What we need to do is replace a couple of files from the Blender, from the Blender BIM installation with symbolic links to our GitHub repo. The folders we need to delete are BIM, Tool, and Core. Delete those three. And now open a new command prompt and you need to be in administrator privileges for this. Run as administrator. And here we're gonna write make link, make link, mk link slash forward slash d. And we'll first um, copy this here and write core because we want to create a folder called core and we'll copy it from this side here. Hit enter and magically we have a core folder that's been symbolically linked to the IFC Open Shell repo. Now we'll do the same for the other two folders we deleted and just like that our three folders have been linked. Now there are a few more that we need to delete so we'll go to libs site, packages, IFC open shell, and here we'll delete the API and the util. But first let's navigate to where it is. So IFC open shell here, Python, 
I have C open shell. And here we go, we have the API and the util. So we can now delete these two, go back to our prompt. And here we'll write make link forward slash paste the first link with uh, this called util and we'll copy this folder up same for the api api okay great we need to go back one level up and look for ifc 4d and 5d which also get updated so we'll delete these two. And here we'll go to IFC open shell, Python, no, yeah. Actually no source. And here we will find the two folders we need. We'll go into IFC 4D, IFC 4D again, go back to the mat prompt. And here we'll write make link slash D. We wanna paste it, well, we wanna make it available there called IFC 4D. And we'll copy this link. Same thing for the 5D. Okay, here we go. Our symbolic links have been created. Now let's assume there have been some new changes from yesterday until today. So the only thing you need to do now to upgrade your Blender BIM version is go to where you've uh, cloned your IFC OpenShell repo and within your folder, open a command prompt and write git pull and here we go you can just do git pull and then anytime you reopen blender you'll have all the latest features and fixes